Blake, it's that time of the year again. The technology world buzzing about the upcoming release of Apple's next smartphone, the iPhone 6S. But my next guest says his company's newest product gives users a higher quality experience than any other smartphone on the market. Joining us right now to tell us more about it is Lee Shen Chang. He is the CEO and USA chairman and CEO uh, of ZTE. Good to see you. Thanks so much for joining us, Lee Shen. Glad to see you Thank again. Thank you very much for joining us. The, the, yeah, you have the phone, but give us your, your vision of the overall smartphone market. What's the opportunity from where you sit? So smartphone has been there for quite some years. As you mentioned, Apple, you know, Steve Jobs did a great job when he came out with the one touch, get consumer to anywhere you want, which would change the whole industry and also consumers' behavior. What we believe now we move into smart 1.0 to smart 2.0 area. We believe consumers with this today's proliferation of the wireless broadband accessibility. So everything is connected. Consumers expecting the smartphone like this will be able to be the control center of everything around you. So we believe the smartphone in the future should be able to understand you as a consumer instead of changing you. So that is what we are focusing. So is the growth largely a, an upgrade cycle in the U.S. or is the growth that you see from population growth outside of the United States? Now, if you talk about the big picture, Maria, so we believe now the penetration is over. So talk about the population. So now it's more talking about instead of penetration rate, it's connection rate. So we believe everything will be connected. So that is really the opportunity. So now from consumer perspective, how you'll be able to control everything around you uh, with your at your fingertips. The Internet of Things. Yeah, what? that is why we come out with a phone yesterday called Axon. You know, it's the first hi-fi audio phone designed in U.S. for the U.S., it's not only an awesome phone, it's a, like a nerve center of everything you do. This that is, is Axon? Yeah. Uh, let's is, show it on camera while, while you talk to Jerry. Yeah, so that is really showing that our vision, how you can control this. Apple, you know, is, for, uh, uh, Apple seems to be ramping up production significantly. They're exp it looks like they're going to try and sell the 6S, uh, the, the next uh, generation of their uh, smartphone, significantly China. How big is the China? The Chinese market clearly is, especially for, for companies like Apple, is a, remains a great opportunity there because, you know, the United States, how many smartphones can you have? But China still has a big market. How big is the Chinese market for smartphones, do you think, over the next five years? China is a huge market, you know. If you talk about population, it's, you know, 1.3 billion people. And the penetration rate is very high. If you're looking at, you know, the really the people going to upgrade their phone every year, it's about 400 to uh, 500 million units every year. So that's a huge market. And particularly in China, it's now focused on domestic consume, consumption-driven economy. So then there is more, you know, market opportunity over there. And how do you are difference? You, so, sorry, Joker. Uh, no, no. I was just wondering, are you concerned about these new companies like Xiaomi that do so well in China that are going to be going to other places in Asia? They're posing a direct competition to you because this phone is $450. A Xiaomi phone or even an Apple phone with the discount is a fraction of the price. Which is where Jerry was going. How do you differentiate yourself in the U.S.? Yeah, I think that's the key thing. You know, we come U.S. back in 1998. During the last five years, we have increased our market share from almost 0% now to 21.9% for the no contract space. And now overall, we are number three in Android market. We are focused on affordable premium. And we, that is the key. You talk about price, that's very uh, good, you know, but the difference is also the subsidies from the carrier is different. We are doing business with all the carriers. The key thing is we get things right. We earn the trust from the carriers, which is very high quality standard. Yeah, Li Shen, stay right here. We want to continue this, get your take on the Chinese economy right now. Uh, 